Welcome to VLSI lecture series. In this video, I'll be explaining you multiplexer in Xilinx using Verilog. So let us first create a new project over here. So I'm creating new project over here. And first let us give name to it. I'm giving MUX Mux name to it. And you can see the location where it is stored. And then some basic settings that we need to do. If you forget to have those settings, then you can pause the video and do those settings. After that, I'm just creating new source where I'm just creating new source file. And after giving name, I just need to select Verilog module. Once I select Verilog module, it will be showing inputs and outputs. So here I'm making four cross one multiplexer. So for that, there will be four inputs Y1, Y2, Y3, Y4 and selection line as input and one output is there. Let us say my output is y and selection line that i have written you can see one jam zero to s1 so that will be having selection line and output is y so that is how we can define input and output and you can see those input output over here so this is how source file is getting created with input and output so this is my source file with defined inputs and output here my output is y so with that, I just need to give register as there is a wiring connection. So I'm defining my output Y as a register over here. You can see REG space Y. So that will define my output as a register. Now I need to define logic for multiplexer operation. So for that, I'm writing always at the red star where my selection line is S1 as input. You can see. So with that, I'll be providing cases and based on cases, it will be functioning. So in case I'm writing in counts S1 that will define various cases where if S1 is 00, zero for that, I need to write 2 into B00 zero zero, gem Y is equals to Y1 means my output Y is equals to Y1 in case of selection line S1 is 00, zero. if I write 2 into B01 in that case my output will be Y is equals to Y2 if my selection line is 10 in that case my output Y is equals to Y3 and if my selection line that is 11 means 2 into star B11 in that case my output will be Y is equals to Y4 so see this is how we have defined case over here and that is how multiplexer functions as we know so this is how we have written program of multiplexer now we need to save this program and we need to check for error over here so first let me save this program and let us check it for error so go in simulation and then go in behavioral check syntaxes here you can see there is no error in terms of syntax so we have done this program successfully now I am going to add source file, right? So add new source in that again give file extension name and then select very log text fixture. So once I do that, I'll be having testing of input and output where I can provide different cases to input and output. So now you can see the file which we have generated where Register is Y1, Y2, Y3, Y4 and selection line that is S1 which is 1 gem 0 right and here initial input condition that is also written. So here for our case for a testing of output in terms of waveform I'll provide different cases with delay of 100 nanosecond. So first I have considered Y1 is equals to 1 and Y2, Y3, Y4 is equals to 0 and I'm providing selection line as 00. So it should select line Y1 with bit 1. And after that, there will be delay of 100 nanosecond that I have written it as hashtag 100. Now, second situation that I have provided over here where little bit change that I would like to mention. You see, if I have Y1 is equals to 0, Y2 is equals to 1. And if I provide selection line is 0, 01 in that case, Y2 will get selected, right? And that will be resulting into our output. And in third situation, I have provided Y3 is equals to 1 with selection line 10. And in fourth case, 
I have selected Y4 line as 1 with selection line is equals to 1 1 with delay of 100 nanosecond. So this is how I have provided four different cases for our output operation and I am saving it and now I am just checking for simulation. So let us check behavioral check here there is no error. So now after having a simulation of this you can see our output waveform you can observe over here our waveforms where input y1 y2 y3 that we have provided with respect to delay of 100 nanosecond and if you observe our selection line that is 0 0 0 1 and 1 0 and 1 1 right and with respect to that our output that you can observe so that is 1 in all situation why the reason is first it was selecting y1 for 0 0 case after that it was selecting y2 for 0 1 case then it was selecting y3 for 1 0 case and then it was selecting y4 for 1 1 selection line and output waveform that you can observe as we have seen it for multiplexer and operation that we can verify it over here by waveforms i hope you know how multiplexer functions you can go through my video based on digital electronics and here that verification can be done based on waveform thank you so much for watching this video